Hey guys, we're here at the KOA. All right, I love you. Uh, there's our 4th of July directions. Decorations, not directions. There's my beautiful wife, my beautiful little dog. Coming to say hi. Hi, Princey. But we're gonna spend a few days here. We're gonna fish the pond. See if we can catch any fish. <coughs> We'll be back. I got my 4th of July hat. Merc. Hey guys. Here's the little pond. I know there's some little bluegill in here. But there might be some decent bass too. They rolled something off the bank. Might have been a turtle. Might have been a bass. But we're going to try it. See if we can catch something. I'm going to start off with a little lizard. No, there's turtles. See them swimming around. I'm put my polarized glasses on so I can see a little bit better. And I do believe in polarized glasses. But I don't believe in spending big money on them. I've got like some yum, yum brand ones from Walmart. No more than $10. Because I'm hard on them. I lose them. I scratch them. I just don't take care of them. But. We do. Oh, 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 oh. Something over there blowing up on probably bluegill. Might need to put my little frog on. Might need to get down here a little earlier. Fish with frogs. But we'll be back to you. Guys, I made my way about, about halfway around the pond. I'm casting a frog now. I've had a few little hits on it. I'm not sure if it was bluegill. Felt one. But like I said, I'm not sure if it's bluegill or little bass hitting it. I just got the little frog going. Working along the bank like a frog would, but haven't hooked up yet. I do have my old standby red worms, my shy bite float. We're going to try those. We're going to give those a try here shortly. We're going to stay out of the tree. Hopefully we can catch a bass. But we'll be right. Oh gosh. Broke out the old cane pole. Really had a few hits on my frog, but I really think they're all blue yet. Maybe maybe one bass. So we're gonna break out the cane pole with some wax worms. I want something big. Or something, I don't know. Ooh, that was big. But we're gonna break out the cane pole with some wax worms. See what we can do. Wax worms, red worms. Little dog is waking up. So we'll be back. Fish on, guys, on the cane pole. Just a little bluegill. But that is a fish.
and we'll put him back. There's another little blue gill. Believe you can hit it as soon as it hits the water. There it is. Hold him a little better so we can get a little better look at him. There he is. Put it back out there, see if we can do it again. Yeah, we're gonna be camera shy. As soon as I leave the camera on to catch a fish, they get shy. But, hope everybody's having a good weekend time with friends and family on this weekend before a holiday hopefully nobody blows their fingers off July 4th I might have a special treat for you special treat for me because I don't fish on July 4th I've hooked my hand twice on July 4th I usually don't fish on July 4th but I have a special date with maybe hopefully a special fish hopefully we can get one and see what we can come together with so everybody watch my July 4th special try to put new species on the list for us but we'll be back probably with some more bluegill. Okay, there's a little red ear. Hold it on my cane pole. Just dropped a white red worm out there. See some beds out there. Put it back. See if we can do it again. small bluegill on the beds up close what I can see there's one right there suck it in as soon as you hit the water little males down there guarding the beds Red is kind of exciting. That might I mean, there might be a big one in here. But I'm just standing here sight fishing these little bluegill on the bed, getting them all worked up, and then casting in there, and one of them comes and gets it. Cast in there a couple of times, jig it through there, and that one of them just comes and wallops it. Just can't handle it coming through there. There's another little female. Nothing big, but it's fun on a cane pole. But next you'll see me unless I catch something big up at the van we're going to do a little scratching 
I got something, guys, on the cane pole. On a red worm, I believe I got me a bass. Hopefully I can get him in. I do. I got me a little bass. <laughs> Nothing big, but... <sighs> I'll show him to you just... Oh, he got off. Well, he wasn't but about a 10-incher. But I seen him come up by his log, and I tried to get him to hit that frog, and he wouldn't do it. So I cast it out to my cane, got my cane pole back out, put a red worm down there by it, and he sucked it in. I didn't get a good hook set on him. But that makes me know that there's bass in here. He had been big enough to hit that frog, but I don't know if he had been big enough to eat it. So... We will come back out here this evening for sure and try that frog more. Oh, there's a bluegill. But. We'll be back. I got a bass on again, guys, on the cane pole. I might actually get to touch him, show him to you. There he is, what a whopper, but he is a bass. I think I might have just seen a catfish roll up in here. It looked kind of mangy, but I might have just seen a catfish come up in this little cove. I was going to be done fishing, but I think I'm going to keep trying, but we'll be back, there he is. Hey guys, back here at the band, we're going to scratch off Maryland and Virginia, hope everybody's enjoying their Fourth of July weekend. We're here close to Washington, D.C. We rode through Washington, D.C. yesterday. Took a few pictures on a ride through. I don't think we'll go back because it's hot. We've got our little dog. And it's just too hot for that. So we'll try to come back at a later date so I can show my wife around Washington, D.C. It's where my dad grew up. It's where my mom met my dad, but let's scratch these off. Twenty-five and twenty-six. And like I said, I got a special trip coming up July 4th. Hopefully we can put a new species on my list. So I appreciate y'all watching. Like, share, and subscribe. Sharp hooks to you.